Good luck, All man. All right. Let's go. All right. I, I see a Lucina on the screen. I also oh see God. a Cloud on the Let's screen. Let's go. I didn't even know Carflow even had a Cloud. But you know what? Manza, so... You know, Manza... Oh, my God. What do I want to say? How do I phrase this? He has many swords. He has a lot of characters in the pocket. That's what I want to say, essentially. But the John, though, almost out of zero to death. And that preemptive up eight out of shield could have been disastrous. But you already know. Simple cloud back air, cross slash. Cloud get already that damage at on. limit here. Only a couple seconds already inside. And now we're sitting. Carflow has got the limit. When is he going to use it? Good up air action. This is definitely an advantageous stage. This stage pretty much is for both. Pretty evened out. I don't think there's an advantage stage, but nice bear all the way out there. Yeah, John. This, this is definitely the battle of true funnies out here. And Dude. spacing as well. You know, you I land on shield parries. like that. <laughs> you got that uppy coming out. And a very good uppy on that back air out of shield. It is minus three though, so you always gotta be careful. If you just just don't grab it. Simply don't grab it. <laughs> always gotta be mindful of that spacing tool in question. Right, two swordsmen here. Pretty neutral stage. Not one character, probably. I don't think any character has an advantage due to the stage here. Up special out of shield, not gonna connect. Good pressure on that shield there by Dijon. Dijon? Did I say that right? Yeah, Dijon Mark. Dijon Mark. Good Nair. Yeah, we're seeing just a lot of swords, you know, footsies in question of them just scrapping, get, getting one, two hits here because these are characters that mainly just go off their strings and try to get a nasty punish game going. But when you do have limit like this and an unteckable, you will be getting a stock like that. Now Carflow still having the limit to burn here. Probably just gonna shove it off for a blade beam. There you go. But it just narrowly misses the John. Right. Limit about ha almost close to halfway filled. Ooh, the shield break. It's gonna take advantage. That's gonna be the stock. Nice job. Good job, Mark. Breaking that shield, ending that stock. Very nice job. Yeah, and there was the up out of shield trying to get some solid damage on, but no, it was not working out. And now John still doing an amazing job at controlling all of this space, trying to up get that free damage. Nah, uh, and still swinging out of disadvantage with that down air. You're still going to be holding some of this damage here. Good job playing so patiently, waiting on that landing to strike with that down air. Very nice job. And we're seeing, oh, here comes Limit. At this point, he might have to utilize Limit to recover here. He had such high percentage. Yeah, and oh, trying to get the follow-up off the up air. Oh, not work out here. He's probably going to have to burn the... There you go. Tried to get yeah. the blade beam out, but it didn't come out as the Limit version, unfortunately. Ran out of time. We're seeing nice grab. Oh, could not juggle at all there. That Nair is going to put in pressure. Oh, oop. Yeah, the John really just trying to lock this face down to get the stock from Carflow. But Carflow is swinging with that forward air here, trying to make an aggressive statement to come back into this game. Oh, unfortunately, that Nair is going to be waiting for uh, Carflow to uh, get back onto stage, and that's going to end the stock. Nice. That was a good set. That was a good match. This is, this is what I honestly love to see. Okay, there's the Roy. There's the Roy. Carful plays Roy Carflow. and Krom, and I did not expect the Cloud. But Ooh. I guess you, Carful, is like, oh, I guess I'll mess around and find out. So now we, we should see a shift in, 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 in gameplay here. Carflow will look to be a lot more aggressive than he was in the previous match. Picking Roy, it's got to be in your face and start to get those combos and those conversions very early on. Yeah, Carflow definitely knows how to make a statement being aggressive with the Roy here. But this is like this this is the battle of sword and shield essentially. It's like you have that great defense and great spacing options with Lucina, but Roy is all about that aggressive swagger. So it's really just gonna be a battle of who can just get their advantage state kinda That's going. Right. Get the win cons going. It seems like Carflow is locking it down first here. Carflow's gotta make sure that he's not letting Dijon breathe at all. That's the gameplay that we want to see, making sure that he sticks to Dijon like white on rice is exactly what we want to see. Oh, seeing the pokes here. Yeah, trying to set up for those tech chases, but it's not going to work out. Still, Dijon holding some phenomenal stage control right now, trying to trap it. You see Carflow trying to get back to that stage, but no, this is Lucina. 
Harpo doing such a good job getting back into stage and maintaining that advantage right in the middle. And now we're seeing Carflow with the lead. Okay, he's a Roy, 102%. He's definitely at kill percentage. Yeah, trying to get the spacing on, but okay, very good Van Huff to just get back to center stage here. Still trying to find this landing. Gets some solid extra credit before the stock goes up and blows up, but that is definitely gonna be a kill here. There we go, and Dijon making it out clean. Second stock, two stock to two stock now, let's see. Gotta see more parries, I gotta see these, these parries come out and more conversions. That's the sortie neutral, honestly. You gotta get the parries going, you, do. you gotta get the conversions going. I already see that Carful is having some masterful trapping Just out here. You go. see this? Take, definitely taking advantage of that Roy speed to come in with those multiple fares right off the stage. Nice spot dodge Ooh. that almost reads the roll. Yeah, that way was super clean from Carflow. And now still trying to trap it at ledge. There's that Uppy, out of sh Uppy just coming out, trying to interrupt the whole flow, but Carflow is still on this right now. Both players pretty evenly matched here at percentage. I kind of feel like Carflow's got a little bit of a, of an advantage here so far. Really showing. Oh, that could. The tides can be turning here. Let's see what happens. Yeah, the John giving him the good old shove with the back throw. You see that? I did. He's like, I don't want any of that. And I can see Get that they're both catching onto each other's <laughs> like spot dodges, which is a pretty good mix-up if you're just throwing out a safe area oh, like that. Oh, and that forward special combo is gonna do it, and just like that, Carflow is now in the lead, but again at percentage, death percentage. Yeah, the John really fiending for the pivot F tilt burst option and that down tilt kill. And there's the up out of shield trying to get out of that combo, but you only got 40%, my friend. That is still pretty low. And look at that. You're still holding so much more for that. Carflow increasing the deficit every single time. They keep trying to return back onto stage. Tries to get the spike, and that's gonna be it. That's gonna do it. You know, that's crazy. That's the first time we saw that all set. That's the, that's the first time yeah, we saw Jab back here. That's so like the tried and true here. Roy class. I know. I was expecting to see more of that. Very nice. All right, who's next? Who's next? Oh, no, we have, uh, is it, uh, it's one to one, right? Yep. Yep, it is one to one right now. And I imagine that Carflow will stay up on that Roy train. And not switch to Krom or anything. I see, you know, the John used to play Kirby. Oh, I interesting. Feel, I guess from he, Kirby to Swordsman? I guess he fully switched over to Lucina, because that's all I feel like I see from the John on. All right. Oh, he but going to Smashville, this is definitely a very good stage for Carflow, because Roy wants that aggressive CQC, like that small close quarters pretty much. Right. But it seems like the John's already starting off to a very good start. This is very good, 60% and having the trap. Still, you cannot touch the ground right now. Oh my god, not oh that 92? Carflow is going to look to pretty much cover most of that, that, that ground game with a lot of his speed to cover most of the ground. Trying to read the landings is going to be really where he wants to be at with Roy. He's able to get back onto stage. Nice job there, Carflow. Sitting at 121%, he's in the danger zone. But all right, we right out of the zone and right into the fire right now. Right. Trying to trap at the ledge, not let this Lucina in whatsoever. Having that tech roll in, but Ooh, no. the up special out of shield's gonna do it. And now Carflow trying to get the F smash oh, lead. Trying to read it, no, nope. gotta roll in, nope. Nah, I get it, I feel ya. John is like, not today, my <laughs> friend, not today. Yeah, but th down 13%, that's not so bad. See, you got Dancing Blade and the small last one, baby. You know what I have work? not seen? I haven't seen any counter uh, pressure mix-ups there. Honestly, uh, counter is a pretty big commitment. It's like, honestly, think of a counter like a read, basically. You only want to throw it out if you know your opponent's going to be really like mashing know. here. And if your opponent's like mashing, mashing, then you already know you want to be throwing out those right. counters oh, every now and then. Nope. John. Almost throws a counter there to mix up. Yeah, we got that jab back air action going on whatsoever and trying Ooh. to get the aggressive dancing blade. Not gonna cut out, allowing the John to take control of the center here. And this corner still yeah. keeping powerful, but there nice, we go. Nice, so special. 
Both of these players are just spot dodging. They're just reading each other's movements so well. Yeah, there's a lot of patience here on the second stock here. Both of them trying to get their win cons, and yep, sliding right in there for the back air. I already know Carpo looking to retaliate real quick with another back air. And it's right back this to This is me. a nice, clean matchup here, just resetting this fresh last stock. The player's trying to poke the shield, and it's not going to happen. No special right at his shield there. The John doing such a good job maintaining advantage. Here comes those up here. Let's Ooh. go. Multiple efforts are starting to pop off. All aboard, baby. Let's go. 52% and still having this. Please, please let me down from here. Very please let strong. me down from here. You cannot leave the floor, my oh, friend. Oh, and now oh. we're getting the answer from Dijon. Nice. Putting so much pressure on that shield. But answering back with that speed that we know Roy can have over his opponents. Yeah, that pivot F tilt putting in so much work. The same for the John. Now this is pretty damn close. Everybody in the venue real close. They're rooting for their boys, the John out here. But he's not able to get the follow up off the down tilt. This is I so close. Up air. We got a real oh, good That's going to be up air. That's going to be it. Carflow. Carflow with the win.